Today's scripture reading begins in verse 3 of John chapter 4. Jesus left Judea and went away again to Galilee, and he had to pass through Samaria. So he came to a city of Samaria called Sychar, near the parcel of land that Jacob gave to his son Joseph. And Jacob's well was there. So Jesus, tired from his journey, was just sitting by the well. It was about the sixth hour. A woman of Samaria came to draw water. Jesus said to her, Give me a drink. For his disciples had gone away to the city to buy food. So the Samaritan woman said to him, How is it that you, though you are a Jew, are asking me for a drink, though I am a Samaritan woman? For Jews do not associate with Samaritans. Jesus replied to her, If you knew the gift of God and who it is who is saying to you, Give me a drink, you would have asked him, and he would have given you living water. She said to him, Sir, you have no bucket, and the well is deep. Where then do you get this living water? You are not greater than our father Jacob, are you, who gave us the well and drank of it himself and his sons and his cattle? Jesus answered and said to her, Everyone who drinks of this water will be thirsty again, but whoever drinks of the water that I will give him shall never be thirsty, but the water that I will give him will become in him a fountain of water, springing up to eternal life. The woman said to him, Sir, give me this water, so that I will not be thirsty, nor come all the way here to draw water. He said to her, Go. Call your husband and come here. The woman answered and said to him, I have no husband. Jesus said to her, You have correctly said, I have no husband. For you have had five husbands, and the one whom you now have is not your husband. This which you have said is true. What gives you a sense of fulfillment and purpose? Is it your family, job, hobbies, or relationships? None of these are wrong but they can easily disappoint if you haven't made the Lord your chief pursuit in life. While Jesus was sitting by a well in the region of Samaria, he met a woman who was vainly seeking fulfillment. She'd been married five times, and most likely each broken relationship left her feeling more unloved than before. As they talked, Jesus pinpointed her sin by revealing that she was now living with a man who was not her husband. He wasn't being cruel, but instead was helping her recognize that she needed a Savior. Every prior attempt to fill up her life had been futile, and now Jesus offered the only solution that truly fulfills, Himself. He offered to give her living water, which satisfies so completely that whoever drinks of it will never thirst again. Do you ever feel like the Samaritan woman? Dissatisfied with life and thirsty for love, purpose, or fulfillment? Surrender to Jesus Christ and allow His life and love to flow through you. Only then will you experience the fullness He promises.